all right uh, welcome back folks so in this series now what we will be covering in the first introductory video we have seen why we need a accessibility second we have seen uh, how to turn that on accessibility option right now we will be covering the ribbon right this is the ribbon we have available accessibility review and color how to do a formatting in this um, entire data set simply i'll just select this um, and then I just fill color and filled font color. But prior I move to the uh, color section, I need to just click on this option. So when I do check. a formatting over here, suppose I close this and I want to see that if in case this is an accessible or not, that time what I'll do, I'll just select this, correct? This is the window has been open. Similar fashion, this is the check accessibility. Okay, when we do any kind of a formatting in the specific table or maybe data set that time this option will turn right on cool suppose i want to check a spelling i'll say cool spelling then it's saying a mail okay so i've intentionally typed that mally so it's now a mail i just click on this option change it's a change now okay spell check is complete you are good to go so spell check has been done for me now i'll say fill color okay so this is the fill color i use a fill color like this and then font color this cool now you could see i have uh, intentionally selected this uh, pale green color which is a bit lighter right so now you could see in the right hand side hard to read a text and contrast e5 which is this you will double click on this and your cursor suppose your cursor is here and when you click on this option you automatically see this um, particular e5 right it automatically get selected and you can see uh, this text and there is a challenge suppose i keep this color here as well here as well and then entire this suppose i select this and i say where is the exactly problem so this is selecting entirely and i can change the color from here directly to black cool so now there is a no issue occurred so basis that we have seen this option called font color spelling check and accessibility now we'll see the fill color as well okay suppose i selected this and i kept it color like this okay the text whatever added at the top right it will automatically get merged at the back end right now i want to see where is the exactly challenge okay now folks uh, if you could see right this data set is a very limited for me right when you have a multiple kind of on a data okay when you have a big data uh, in your spreadsheet and you want to work on those spreadsheets accordingly that time this option will really help you a lot cool now in the next video series we will be covering topic called style